Hi, let's take a look at our spell out feature. So a spell out feature will spell out a certain number in letters. So this will only be supported by our formatting type ICU. So make sure that the formatting type ICU is set on new .conflicts, it will be automatically set. And uh, what I have here is I have a data source. In my data source, I have a field called tracking number. And as you can see, it's of type number. It has to be of type number, otherwise the spell out feature will not be available. Okay, then I have an, uh, um, a config type for a spell out. If I take a look at it, this one, you will see that if I select the tracking number, then uh, the, uh, the spell out is not available for order number, but for tracking number. Uh, let's write it a tracking number. But for tracking number, it is available. So I select spell out in letters. Okay. And then I'm going to save my configuration. This entire spell out is dependent on the locale that you are using. So let's take a look. If I set my locale to uh, English, English, uh, sorry, English US here. So uh, let's take a look how that will be spelled out. You will see that it says 45. Now, if I change the locale to another uh, to another country or another language, for instance, I will to choose uh, German in Germany. Okay, then if I go again to the spell out, it will hopefully do that in German. Fünf und vierzig. So that's correctly spelled out. Now, if I would take no formatting, uh, no locale here. And it will take the locale of my current user and that is set in dutch because i'm dutch speaking so if i'm now would uh, run the formatting demo it says so that's indeed how we would spell it in dutch